Let's give him a little bit more time. Yeah, 143. Yes, working out. No, not him. Uh, grab these two. Check the strength out. Look, <laughs> 300 troops. The Stalin clan, of course. Which one? And Ingram has 200 as well. For some reason, some of these like have really, really low like party capacity. I don't quite understand. I dethroned the Ragnar, I didn't say I want I was really gonna kill him, so let's yeah, let's let him be. Okay, I see this guy this guy almost has a full party. And there he goes. Be a better idea if you never tell him to like recruit specific troops, unless you're playing like with them all, like the Eagle Rising, when their Roman infantry is just so much better. Yeah, seventy. I just need that one guy over there to like recruit more. No, that guy can damn battle with looters. God damn it. You know what, Ragnar? Fuck you. You piece of shit. Oh, we can't. We actually can't. Look at that. You're preventing my own guys from re recruiting troops, you piece of shit. You moron. And for that, I'm gonna take your head. Or he's gonna take your head, I guess that works out as well. <laughs> okay, yeah, that's good enough. Um, diplomacy. I actually have support for war, but I can just do that. Save just in case the game crashes again. Grab them. Let's grab him. Him. Sammy Son clan, of course. We can't do anything without Sammy. Look at that. The Stelnik clan is really pushing it. Look at that. The, look at the. Jesus Christ. They rival me. More or less. Now the idea is going to be, of course, to like knock out one of their big armies that comes comes our way. But they are at war on three. F well, they're at war with factions that don't exist anymore. Well, it's not going to stop them, I don't think. Catch him now! Come on! Some reason it looks like I'm I'm faster than the party over there. Oh, 
Right, I know what we should do. Uh... Of course, that's gonna happen. Meh, well, I'll let them. You know what we should do? We should just uh, sit at Epic, uh, besiege this, and hold. Simple, um, I mean, the AI always just brings an army to destroy you there. So we should be. Yes, why the hell not? Let's declare. This is total war. We're gonna declare war on everyone. That seems to work out fine. Let's besiege this. And they look at that. A thousand man army as well. Besieging Gregor's castle. What is up with the... Why that one? Why not... The shit they got in our lands? Okay, but uh, the idea here is we're gonna besiege this and they're gonna bring uh, all their armies on. We'll declare war on the Batanians, but we can't. Where the fuck are you going? Right, there should be a little siege equipment, right? We're at war with the whole world. Except the battalions. See, the idea is, is to wait for them to like gather enough troops there to attack us, because otherwise, I don't think I don't think we're gonna run into a big army of theirs anytime soon. It would be funny if the AI actually like. Pieces out everyone else and just wail uh, like uh, uh, jumps on us. Okay, apparently they gave up on defending this and they go on to defend the castle over there. actually took Gregor's castle. Amazing. And the Sturgeons apparently have an army. That's something. Okay, Clan Stelnik deserves it. That's for sure. Unfortunately, we have an aggression pack with them for 76 days. Otherwise, I would declare war on them as well. I mean, they should be able to, like... Take a lot of stuff away from us, at least. I'll try, at least. Yeah, the, the, the drumming castle is already besieged. I wish I could fucking zoom out, man. Let's see what's going down. It's 
the whole setup. Let's take the richest town in the game. Mm, at least, mm, I think. Yeah, I think the epic, epic, epicreta or whatever it's called uh, is is the richest town in the game. Should be anyway. Slap that in the middle. So placing archers here here is gonna be a pain in the ass. Yep. Troops inside the walls as well. Didn't do that at home, kids. You're gonna get killed. Don't be as dumb as dumb as I am. Actually, uh, a nice change fighting in Imperial cities for once. It was like other castles got a little bit boring. This battlefield actually supports most of the archers. They're really nice, nicely spread about on the barricades. As always, you want a number advantage, so wait a little bit till you kill off some of their troops. Hello there. Right there, infantry has peel them. If you don't sit there and look at them. Yeah. Okay, since the archers aren't shooting, let's just move in. Not in shield wall though. Then I'm gonna move the archers in as well. A later bit. Alright, they got yeah, they got Pilum. Run 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 run. Don't get stuck on the ladders though. Now, this is how you siege man. You get up the walls with on your horse. Come on. Oh, there's actually enemies in here. Shit. 
How did I not see that coming? I was the only one inside of there. Oh, this side didn't fare well on their on th their side on this side didn't fare well. What the what? Where the fuck? What? Yeah, turn, turn around, turn around. You, f you fucking morons. Jesus Christ, the game pisses me off sometimes. Eighty thousand experience, Jesus Christ, man. Uh, oh, I'm gonna decline. Actually, I can actually dump prisoners. Amazing. All right, let's uh, put a couple. Wait, what? Didn't I dump the prisoners in... What? I don't know. Uh, recruit a couple of uh, garrison units. The mercenary, mercenaries as garrison units. Good check. Yeah, we pretty much have the highest tier stuff. Okay, I'm gonna take that, so just so I don't have to look at the fur... Well, uh, ...glitching through the shield anymore. Wanna get, hey, wanna fight? Anyone wanna fight? Surely there's like a decent amount of them here. Should we do the cheesy, cheesy strat here? Let them besiege them. <laughs> and they appear, we appeared, uh, they appeared right next to us. Oh, that's fucking stupid. Okay, let's see how they fare in battle. Now, the one thing I don't like uh, in this... Oh my god, it's a British battle. Happy birthday to me. Unfortunately, we are the attacker. Uh... So I can say, uh... Uh, 
I have... I don't know, my mind drew a blank now. Right, the tactics don't make that much of a difference. Like, we all number them. There's 800 of them, there's 2,000 of us. So in theory, we should have more troops on the field, but nope, it doesn't work like that anymore. Which I guess makes the game kind of fair, but not really. a bit too late for them then we're gonna have to cross the rubicon oh jesus christ hold your cavalry take a part under my orders follow your sergeants i'm gonna have to cross the rubicon but you go the shield wall wait a minute There's another bridge. What? What we're separated by, uh... We're separated by a waterfall, apparently. Look! Oh my... Oh, ooh, ooh, this might be... This might be a little bit tricky. A oh, fuck off. Uh... Their reinforcements are gonna spawn over there somewhere. At least they should. But if this this, this might uh, be a little bit more difficult than it seems, even though we outnumber them, but the, by so much we're gonna get flanked in the ass. Ragged old man. Actually, I'm curious where they're gonna spawn at, to be honest. But one thing is certain, it's gonna suck for us. This is... Ooh, look at this. It's gonna be good if there are... Uh, Reinforcements spawn over there on that side of the bridge. Guess we'll find out soon enough. They have. More archers up here, though. This this is a this is a fucking weird one. To say the least. Caesar move, right? Except we're gonna, not gonna have a fourth. We're gonna have a bridge with the enemy in front of us and another bri bridge with enemies behind us. We 
Okay, I hope so. I'm not gonna get shot in the back, but I probably will if I keep looking this. Oh, look at that, their infantry is thinking they're charging through the water. That's fucking dumb. Of tail worlds. They added in uh, impassable water in bridge battles. But they. The yeah, apparently still thinks they can cross this area. Even though there's an invisible wall. They need to fix that ASAP. Oh no, their enforcements actually spawn on that side. Interest. Oh, look at that. I think. Or or no. I have no clue. I don't know, this one is weird as hell. Looks like their cav is spawning over there, but their infantry and uh, the archers are spawning over here across the bridge. Yeah, like I said, they, they, like the biggest uh, for us with the Imperials is going to be their cav, their lancers. They literally spawn on the bridge. And maybe like placing the archers right here might be a better idea. This one is all kinds of weird. The infantry might actually break through our lines. Oh, no, no, our infantry is coming in. We're good. Okay, I'm not gonna watch this because the AI is gonna retreat and do some super shit, so we're gonna just not resolve the rest of the battle. Forty-eight K experience and a shitload of horses as well. Okay, now let's see if this this army over here turns around and besieges it as well. Going to a point, I always like looking at that. Hmm, can we actually catch him? 
Nope. Let's see what they're gonna do. Right, let me check the empire. Okay, that's of course that's gonna fall. There's no way we're gonna hold that. Mm, doesn't seem like we lost anything so far. No, we're still holding everything. Well, except this, right? Yeah, I think they're... Where are they going? Besieging... They're... This. Yeah, they're going all the way from here to here. Makes sense, doesn't it? Let me see if they, like, turn around or something. Because there's no way I'm going to follow them all the way over there. Actually, let's just disband this army. That's being besieged. Gregor's castle is being... Of course, it's going to be besieged. It's only been taken right now. Let's grab these and see what the rest of our... Okay, look at that. Yeah, look at that. No, they're only traveling. They're not going to besiege, apparently. And these mother... Did they actually execute Ragnar? Ah, oh, shit. I think I forgot. Ah, oh, shh. Right, he was attacked by some other, other lord, right? Actually, surprised we can actually catch up to him. army of well didn't get enough troops to actually challenge us what I will I did what I could do I mean I already won a, a shitload of battles versus uh oh god the really shitty odds Him to come at me. Yep. And that's why I take the the, the guys who can yeah these oof something and not the house cars they actually have spears for the horsemen oh come on let me watch the battle
it freeze, Jesus. The battles are slower, but they like uh, kind of, kind of a little bit more realistic. So we are gonna use that for every other playthrough I do. Two guys left. Okay, there we go. Only 18 losses on our side as well. Sure. Seventy-three thousand experience. Oh, look at this! Better helmet, finally. Sweet upgrades. Mm, anything else besieged? Like the whole the wars, Jesus. I was expecting them to take this back for that big army that went this way to take that back. But they apparently decided against it. Didn't I already do this? Maybe I'm losing it. It is uh, past midnight as well. I mean, we bought, uh, fought a couple battles. I mean, that's it, basically. The idea for this playthrough is the, to the throne Ragnar, and that's it. Take out, uh, take the whole Northern Empire and test out the faction fraction thing. Mm, and it, it, it kind of is annoying, but it can work. So it's, it's easy to take all uh, the whole map over. It just takes. Time. Time which we don't have. Maybe, maybe in like five years, once all the fancy mods are out, then we're gonna do the like really long campaigns where we take the whole map. But uh, this is gonna be when the game like actually releases. So, this is gonna be it for this one. So, the next one is gonna be the Samurai Tessujin one. With guns, with the whole empire in one faction, if I can get all that to work. So, we'll see what happens. Anyways, guys. Sub on YouTube, follow on Twitch, do you live Uh If you need, a, if you have any questions or need any mods from the, from the ones I'm using, you can find them on Gilded. And thank you for watching. Have a good morning, good day, good night. See you next time.